The following segment has been sponsored by Grayscale Investments. What is the state of crypto in America? Well, a recent survey uncovered how Americans view crypto, including their outlook on its regulation. And here with more is the chief legal officer at Grayscale Investments, Craig Somm. Welcome to the show. Great to have you. Lots to dive into here. First and foremost, what is crypto and why should we consider adding it to our portfolios? Uh, yep, yeah, Rachel, thank you so much for having me. I'm Craig Somm. I'm the chief legal officer at Grayscale Investments. Grayscale is the world's largest crypto asset manager. Our mission is to bring access and exposure to the crypto asset class in the form of traditional investment vehicles. In terms of what is crypto, it is a digital asset that allows anyone to send money anywhere in the world just with an internet connection. You don't need a centralized intermediary like a bank. That's a very powerful tool and why a lot of our investors have come to us to express their interest by investing in our investment vehicles. We recently conducted a survey along with Harris Poll that really got to how our investors thinking about Bitcoin and crypto amidst the upcoming election. So very much to, you know, looking forward to being here with you today and, and talking about those findings. Yeah, obviously you're, the, you're a good person to talk to about this. You're someone who understands it well enough that there isn't this hesitancy. I think that's the general consensus that I hear a lot of is we're not really sure what it is, how it works. And so we'll see if it just goes away. It's not going away. Like crypto seems here to stay. And that's kind of what this survey touches on. So can you bring us through some of the key takeaways? Yeah, so some of the key findings that we found are number one, investors and likely American voters are starting to take an interest in crypto amidst increases in inflation, which is actually the number one concern on likely American voters' minds with the upcoming election. That's more than two times any other concern that was mentioned. And given that, we think it makes sense that likely American voters are looking to things like crypto because they have served as a hedge against inflation since the supply of a lot of these digital assets is fixed or deflationary rather than inflationary like the US dollar has become. Another key finding we found is that like the American voters view crypto very much as a bipartisan topic. Mm -hmm. No one political party, whether it's Democrat or Republican, has more or less of a favorable view. So we think that's important that there's a bipartisan or really nonpartisan, we like to think of it as, since crypto at its core is a technology and we don't think it should have any sort of partisan view to it. And then number three is that like the American voters are starting to view crypto as more transparent and more trustworthy. That follows the recent approval of Bitcoin ETFs in the US, of which Grayscale offers one, which is a regulated investment vehicle that has really proven to be the optimal way for investors to gain access to any asset class. And so we view that as a very legitimizing moment and one of the reasons why likely American voters continue to think more and more about Bitcoin and crypto. Yeah, so much to dive into here. I think the nonpartisan element is key here, but I'm also curious what you think about different generations and how they view it. There seems to be a divide, at least on the surface level. Is that true, according to the survey? So as you might imagine, our survey did find that younger voters tend to view crypto more favorably than older voters, although there are certainly older voters that are very much interested. Um, and we think that also aligns with, with our understanding since younger voters grew up in a digital world and so for them it's a lot easier to grasp how money should be digital as well um, but the overall findings are that nearly half of american voters are interested in crypto especially with the upcoming election so we think that's a very important number to be focused on yeah certainly top of mind with the debate tonight as well there's a lot on everyone's minds if you wanted to learn more what's the best place to go can we head online Yep, so to learn more about Grayscale, just visit grayscale.com. And to learn more about our survey, visit grayscale.com slash elections. Amazing. Craig, thanks for being here this afternoon. We appreciate your time. Yep, Rachel, thank you so much for having me. The previous portion of PA Live has been sponsored by Grayscale Invest.